Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm bringing you some more Shogun Steel Beyblade action. We have Gladiator Bahamut today. So this is one of the villain bays. I can't remember the guy's name. He kind of looks like a weird version of Kai um, in the anime. So yeah, this is uh, Gladiator Bahamut. One, uh, it's made the main villain bay basically before, well, after the like before he evolves the bay into, um, I believe Berserker Behemoth is the evolved form of it. So yeah, we have the Shogun Face Bolt, which is the Bahamut, then the Warrior Wheel, which is Bahamut, Element Wheel, which is Gladiator, and we have the Spin Track, which is SP230, and then moving on, we have um, Giga Flat. So yeah, some pretty good parts, especially that Gigaflat. Gigaflat's one of the better tips in um, the uh, metal verse. So yeah, very nice. All right, let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. Um, I purchased it on Amazon. You can buy these on Amazon for anywhere between 14 to $24. Um, Archer, Griffin, and bandit golem for some reason are actually 24 dollars like 24 49 or something weird like that all right so we get a interesting cream color tool disc uh tool a gray ripcord uh, a gray launcher then we have our um gladiator bahamut card which that no longer works um then we have our very cool looking Bahamut face bolt. And last, well, moving on, we have our, um, our Bahamut warrior wheel. Our element wheel, which is gladiator. This is actually really cool. And then our SP, 230 spin track very nice very nice i thought this actually flipped upside down but hey it is what it is kind of interesting like really interesting on that hmm. and then our giga flat one of the better tips in all of the metal version all right so let's get the bay assembled and then we will um, yeah, go from there. So yeah, just a quick rundown again. Our Bahamut Shogun Face Bolt. Then our Buhamut Warrior Wheel. I actually kind of like this. This is kind of cool. Definitely unique. Then our Gladiator Element Wheel. Our SP230 spin track. And then our Giga Flat. All right, now we will put the sucker together. Oh. Hey, hey. and we get a purple ripcord too. Very interesting. Purple ripcord. Put this bad boy together. And there we go. There is our Gladiator Bahamut. Super nice. Yeah, very nice. All right. And it's kind of interesting that they gave us a purple rib cord with a gray launcher. Um, would have been cooler if we had gotten like a clear purple, like a clear purple launcher with a purple rib cord. That would have been pretty sick. Like that would have been really sick. There we go. Yep. Another ripcord for the ripcord collection. All right, so you know the drill. We got our bays. We're gonna zoom out here. 
we got our bays we're going to do some spins and some battles we're still going to use the quad strike stadium um until i find a better stadium or until i get the zero g stadium um i plan on trying to get the zero g and i mean not the zero g the shogun still actual stadium that comes with uh salamander and ifrit and then i do plan on trying to get the mobile stadium with thief phoenix and um salamander so those are on the list to collect just bear with me while i'm trying to get them because it is not an easy feat definitely getting some definitely almost there i think we're about almost halfway with the shogun steel bays getting the lineup ready to go so then that way we are good no hiccups and we can get right into the fold of things all right so yeah right away fix that camera angle there there we go all right so now let's take our gladiator bahamut and three, two, one. Kind of getting a little bit of a ramping action going on there. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Give it a little bit of a bump test. All right, yeah, very nice. All right. So, you know, the drill first up is our Inferno Sagittario. Three, two, one. And Just did not stand a chance. First round goes to Bahamut. All right, round two. Another good. Sagittario might do better this time around. Yeah, I definitely did a lot better this time around. Now, the only reason why um, I'm not a fan of Gigaflap being on Gladiator is because Gladiator is too tall. It makes it a little, um, gives it a little bit of a weird movement, and I feel like it just slows down Gigaflap. Like, if anything, I would prefer to put the Gigaflat on Medio, El Drago. All right, Inferno Sagittario taking two points. Inferno wins. Um, next up, moving on to our Spiral Fox. Three, two, one. Spiral Spiral's gonna win here. I already tell you that right now. And Spiral taking victory. Very nice. I love Spiral, you guys. All right, and over it. Yeah, this Beyblade definitely does not work with the stadium gimmick. <laughs> And Spiral Fox wins again. All right. Now it's on to our Herculeo with the stamina build. The circle perform, uh, the circle. Oh my gosh. The circle spin track with the sharp performance tip. Let it rip. And the stamina build is down. And three, two, and yeah, I would definitely be putting the Giga Flat on something like my Medio. Definitely would go on my Medio L Drago.
And Herculeo taking a victory yet again. All right, now it's the original Herculeo facing off against our Bahamut. Let it rip and let it rip. Herculeo is just so low. And Herculeo taking victory. All right. Well, I gotta fix that string launcher. Love it when string launchers go down. And Herculeo taking victory yet again. All right. Pegasus. Can Pegasus beat our Bahamut? All right. And Bahamut takes a loss. Pegasus takes a win. All right, Bahamut's been losing. Losing every match. All right, now we're going to Lightning El Drago. All right. Three, two, one. Lightning. All right, we'll swap modes now. All right, mode change. Three, two, one. And El Drago. All right, now it's our blue lightning. Three, two, one. Our blue lightning takes victory. Let's do the mode change real quick. And I don't know. I love light. I love. I love the El Dragos. Like they're such versatile bays. Probably easily one of my favorite metal fight bays, other than uh, Spiral. Spiral being my first favorite. Three, two, one. <laughs> Does Lightning take home this victory? Can we move on to Medio? Lightning just needs to stay away. Stay away, Lightning. Stay away. And it does. Lightning wins again. Dude, I gotta say, this is, um, it'll be interesting when we get over to Ronin Dragoon. All right, now we're going to Medio. Very nice. We're starting off in Absorb mode. 
Let it rip. Let it rip. And because we're an absorb, <laughs> wow, Bahamut took the, the cop out. Because we're an absorb, next we'll do the hand spin. Medio, very nice. Moving on to round two. Yeah. Okay, let's redo that. Yeah, I had the motion wrong on that hand spin. There we go. I went I went reverse for El Drago. <laughs> and there we go. That's what you would expect from a proper hand spin. Okay, now we're gonna do the mode change real quick to barrage. If I would just stop dropping bay pieces. Okay. Now going into barrage. Okay, yep, mode change. And gladiator Bohambolt. And El Drago making quick work of gladiator Bohambolt. All right, moving on. Now we're getting into the zero G stuff, which is our boy Samurai Ifrit versus Kahamu. All right, Samurai Ifrit taking the first win. Samurai Ifrit taking the second win. Oh man, this is a sad day. All right, our other Samurai Ifrit. All right, three, two, one. <laughs> All right, round one goes to Ifrit. Shinobi Salamander. Let it rip. And Salamander taking victory. Now we're going to flip that spin track the opposite direction real quick. Boom. Boom. And that was weird. Let it rip. Very nice. Salamander taking victory. Now we're moving on to our defense and stamina bays, which are, well, our other ones, which are uh, Pirate Orochi Let it rip. versus Gladiator Pamu. First round goes to Orochi. Let it rip. There we go. That's kind of what I wanted to see. Very nice. All right. Three, two, one. Hey. 
Hey, very nice. We actually see our first win. All right, our first win <laughs> is from is against um, Pirate Orochi. Now we're going on to Kraken. taken victory kind of saw that one coming and kraken taken victory again all right now our last one ronin dragoon facing off against bahamut both weird builds definitely weird builds let her and Ronin, very nice, very nice indeed. Ronin Dragoon taking victory in the first round. I actually figured it was going to be the other way. All right, give me just one second here. I'm working on something. All right, round two, three, two, one. Ronin Dragoon again. All right. So out of the non synchrome Bay battles, we only want uh, Gladiator Bahama only managed to snag one win out of fifth. Um, three, six. Sorry, I'm doing some counting here. Thirteen managed to snag thirteen wins. I mean losses, and only won once. Thirteen losses, you guys. That's that's an atrocity. All right, now we're doing um, Efrit. Well, Salamander Efrit versus. Goes to Salamander E for it. No surprise there. All right. And Salamander E for it wins again. All right. So, yeah, a total of. 14 losses, you guys. 14 losses and one win. This bay is just as bad as Ronin Dragoon. But the only difference is this is supposed to be a balanced bay, and they gave it Giga Flat. <laughs> so um, that definitely doesn't make a lot of sense there. Um, especially the fact that, you know, Giga Flat, I don't know, it's more attack, it's more attack oriented um then then um being able to defend on higher um higher spin tracks like 230 230 is a pretty high spin track i mean compared to lightning el drago you guys lightning el drago was able to just get up underneath and bully its way you know and just keep, keep repeatedly smacking it same with you know both herculeo builds you know it would get up underneath and just you know, do this number and tip it over. Um, I think it's Achilles heel is Giga Flat. Giga Flat, I don't think will, I'm not too keen on, well, I would not use Giga Flat on a stock Bahamut. I would use probably something a little more versatile, like 
you know, your defensive tips or um, some some like sort of like wide, like a wide defense tip would probably suit it a lot better. So that's what I would run with. Um, other than that, you guys, I think it's a fun bay. I do like it, especially the color scheme. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. As always, please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. We're almost to a thousand, you guys. We are almost to a thousand, and thank you so very much. As always, please, uh, three, two, one, let it rip. Have a great day, everyone.